Hi friends, this is Maria and welcome back to my channel. And this morning we're gonna replace a busted fog light and running light of a Buick and Clave. And it's actually my car. And Dan is helping me out do this. And we need to remove some screws behind this light. There's a there's a like cover there by the wheels. And there are screws, uh, we have to remove that and there are several screws to be taken out of the panel. And you can see these screws there. And then there's actually like five. One, two, three, four, five screws that we have to remove so we can replace the bulbs. Make sure before you remove that those screws, you have to turn the uh, tires away from you towards the inside and then uh, I think it's not star screw it's something like square stuff like that and we're gonna find that in the toolbox I'm gonna show it closer that's how the screws would look like and then here there you go I'm trying to make it closer so that it's gonna be clearer I don't know if you can see that that is the kind of screw that we have to remove and then after we remove that we'll be able to reach the um, bulb inside yay it works <laughs> Sometimes it's a little hard if you don't have the right uh, tools. Oh, it opens easily. Nice. So remember that your tire should be like this so if you can access that panel there. Otherwise, it's difficult. Here is a screw that we pulled out of the car. And this is the tool that we use to remove that screw. So since it is open, we can now remove the bulb. So I'll try to move this a little bit. It's hard. <laughs> But yep, we have to remove that cover and we have to reach the bulb inside. So there's more screws down underneath, and that is trying to remove that too. Now you can flap it open and you can peek through it, and those are the uh, lights inside. Uh, we have to identify which one is the fog light and which one is the uh, running light. And here is a closer look inside. There's so many wires here that I don't really understand. Sorry, I'm not an expert in with cars. I'm just trying to assist. <laughs> so this is the fog light that we removed. So that's the fog light. So I'm not sure why it's not uh, working. So we're gonna take that off so we can replace with it, uh, it with a new uh, light. Okay, it's a little bit tricky, and you need to be very careful and patient as well. So it's getting there. It's a little bit tough, and now we got it. So this is the bulb that we have to change, the fog light bulb, and we have to look for the running light. So this is the running light, okay, what is it, there, that's the running light that we also have to replace. So it looks really, really busted.
and here it is we got it too oh yeah so this is the running light bulb it looks this dark, is so the running really light that is busted and it looks different yeah, it's dark. so we probably have to go find some replacement bulb in the hardware so that we can put it back there and my car would be good as new so now so it's time to, to go shopping for the bulb so we're here at qual heinz and this is the replacement bulb you can see the model there the model number of the bulb that's for the fog light that is h11 basic and then the other one this is sylvania and that is 3157 so that will be the replacement for the running light now all we need to do is put it back in the car and this is how it looks so both left and right fog lights and running lights are now working the car is now good to go